everybody and welcome back to another video. I've honestly never been more excited to get a post out to you guys. I had the extreme honor of getting to talk to Bullsa Toy, the company behind the first ever official Wingsfire merchandise, and they offered to send me their products for free for a video. Today I'll be unboxing all of the Wingsfire Cutie Cuff mystery boxes that were sent to me. Inside of each container is a slap bracelet with a plushie of one of our favorite Arc 1 dragons on top. I'm absolutely so, so pumped to unbox these all and show them off to you guys in this review. For those unaware, Cutie Cuffs are available to purchase in every Target, Walmart, and Walgreens in the U.S. Stop by your local store if you're a United States resident and see how many you can collect. Again, huge thank you to Bulls of Toy for sending these in to me and being so nice to the process of working this little collab out. But before we begin, a huge shout out to my patrons as well. Dark Deliver 95, Three Moons, Slightest Wild, Fizz, Thistle, Noobtoe, and Pyro Nuke. Thank you all so much for supporting me. Links to their social medias are in the description down below. Anyways, without further ado, let's get into the video. Okay, so here we have the awesome box at me by Bulls the Toy. I'm so excited to look at this and see all the different cutie cuffs. This is so awesome. They even sent me the actual display case that the cutie cuffs are found in. So here it is. Since they don't actually ship their products out on their website, they send them out to stores. So this is literally the exact little stand that you would see inside the store that you'd buy it in. These are so adorable. I've seen the, uh, the packaging art now. I haven't watched any other unboxings, so this will be kind of my first time really seeing what they look like in the real world outside of their website pictures. And I'm so excited. I'll grab some scissors here and I'll cut in the box and show you guys what I've got. So here it is. We just took off all the wrapping. This is so awesome. So for those wondering, we have Starflight, Blister, Queen Scarlet, Glory. Then on the other side, we have Sunny, Clay, Tsunami, and Moroseer. Surprising is uh, Starflight's colors are a little off, but other than that, all of these literally look so wonderful and adorable. I'm really excited to open up our container here and see all of the ones we got. There are a lot in here. Oh my goodness. I'm going to take all of these out and look at them. But look at this, guys. Look at this. The official Wings of Fire Tui T Sutherland Cutie Cuff. Oh, these are blind boxes, so you don't know which one you're going to get. Although, as some fans pointed out, you can see a little bit of the top. There are some holes up here, so you can kind of see a little bit of the texture and, and understand who you're going to get. So, uh, let's break all of these out and see how many we have, and we'll unbox all of them here today. Oh my goodness, guys, we put these into a pyramid. This is so awesome. This is such a blessing. We got 12 cutie cuff containers right here from the official store box, which is so cool. And I'm going to go through every single one of these and hopefully I get one of each. I am very, very excited. We've taken a lot of pictures. This is such a cool experience. So I'm going to cut off the wrapping in a box who our first one is inside. So we took all of them out of the wrapping and this is so cool. I'm really excited. There is a kind of a little way, like I said earlier, to see if there's a character you really want. On some of them, it's more obvious, like blues and stuff. So you can you can kind of get a glimpse of who you want if there's a character that you're really eyeing. But I have not gotten to look at any of these. I've avoided looking at tons of pictures and everything like that. So this is going to be a total surprise for me. And the lucky one from the top of the pyramid is going to be our first of the video. So I'm going to pop off the top here. Oh, we started off with Starflight. Look at how cute he is. Oh my goodness, he's just the cutest little thing ever. So these are slap bracelets with plushies attached. We can see his adorable little wings and his back spines and his tail. Oh, this is so awesome. He even has his iconic green eyes. This is so cool. I have always loved slap bracelets, actually. This is awesome. And they're like his little outstretched hands. Oh, the, the patterns and everything like that. This is so awesome. I absolutely love it already. And each one comes with its own little container and a sheet where you can mark off which cutie cuffs you have gotten and collected so far. So we have all the different Dragons of Destiny and some of their most iconic Arc 1 villains. And maybe we'll even get more from Bulls of Toy to come. Who knows? 
I absolutely love Surf Light, and I cannot wait. I'm picking off our next one from Off the Pyramid, and we'll see who we get next. We have Blister! Okay, her wings are so shiny. I'm getting a good look at this on the camera. This is absolutely beautiful. Like, the eyes on these are so cute, and the snouts and the horns. Oh, this is awesome. They even added her venomous tail barb stinger, which looks so dope. Oh, my goodness. This is so cool. It looks exactly like how she appears in the different official art for the series. Wow. This is so awesome. You can even see her each individual scale ridges. This one is so cute. All right, here we have our next cutie cuff. Yes, I got Queen Scarlet. This is the one I absolutely wanted the most out of all of them. She is literally like my second favorite Wings of Fire character ever. Number one is Peril. Number two is Queen Scarlet. Wow, she absolutely looks stunning here. Her wings have a glitter effect just like with blisters. And we even get the most iconic look for Queen Scarlet, which is the one with Glory's venom on the side of her face. That is so cool. I absolutely love her little claws. Oh, this one is my favorite of the designs. When I saw the different concept art, when I saw these on the website, I was like, I need a Queen Scarlet one, okay? I will go to the store and buy one if I do not get a Scarlet. But wow, this is just so adorable. She's literally one of my favorite characters. And to actually be holding a plush of Queen Scarlet and, and it's a slap bracelet. That is just so cool. You can even see what she's been described with in the books. The rubies and gems. The amount of detail on the colors and the stitching this is such an awesome merch option. I mean, for us to start off with plushies, that is so cool. Yeah, they're not traditional plushies, but slap bracelet plushies, that was something I never even would have thought of, and I absolutely love it. All right, we have our next cutie cuff right off the top of the pyramid. Oh, we have Glory. Her colors are absolutely gorgeous here and man all of these have had sparkly wings but she even has sparkly frills on top of her head i mean these are just like so book accurate to the covers and the official art of the series and the descriptions i mean everything about this is so cute i love her tail this one is different than the others it's nice and curled i love how unique hers is compared to all the other dragonettes and villains that we even boxed so far this has been such a treat you guys Oh, and her belly has a different texture. Oh, this is so cool. All the different colors come together so nicely for the glory one. I absolutely love it. This is beautiful. Okay, our next cutie cuff. I'm so, so excited. We got another glory. Oh my goodness. I absolutely love her. I cannot wait to give this away to someone. I'll see if anyone I know loves Wings of Fire. This is so, so cute. I absolutely love it. And you can never have too many glories. And our next cutie cuff to unbox. We got Clay. Yes, one of the best mud wings in the series with his beautiful glittery wings. His little bunched up tail. Oh my goodness. I love him. They perfectly nailed Clay's colors on here. They could have done it, you know, like too tan or, or too orangey, but no, like everyone actually looks perfect. I'm genuinely so impressed. He looks exactly like how he does soaring on his book cover and on the box. This is so cool. Just a little baby Clay. I'm just imagining that this is what the Talons of Peace members and the Guardian of the Dragon of Destiny saw when Clay hatched out of his egg. Oh my goodness, that scene was too cute. And... Oh, he was he would not be this tiny because dragons are very massive, but in my mind, he was this small. Oh my goodness, cupping them in your hands. It's just the sweetest thing ever. I absolutely adore these. Okay, I'm so excited to get into this one. And yes, my predictions were correct based on the head floof. We have Sunny, aka my favorite dragon out of Destiny. Oh, she is so cute. I absolutely love how they did her colors. And yes, she does not have a venomous tail barb. Wonderful. 
and I love her little sparkly wings. This is just such a cool addition. It really just brings the characters to life. She is absolutely amazing here with her beautiful green eyes. And I am so, so excited to get to cuddle with this adorable Sunny. She's so small. And she is honestly one of the fiercest of the Dragonettes of Destiny and my personal favorite. I love getting to read The Brightest Night, and I will love getting to read it again with her by my side. I am very hyped to see who we have hiding in here. And yes, another Sunny. Oh my goodness, she is just so cute. I know I keep saying that, but genuinely, I adore the design for these, like, so much. Oh my goodness, she's going to have her sister right here. Here's our collection so far. Now we just need Tsunami and Morrisir. Now unboxing who we have inside. Oh, another clay. Oh, these are so, so cute. Oh my goodness, I absolutely love him. And now they have their twins, maybe even triplets. This is so cool. Yes! We have Moros here! Oh my goodness, wow. This might be my second favorite of the designs, just after Scarlet herself. The wings are so awesome and black, and everything on here, the colors, this just screams Moros here to me. He looks not quite as menacing, but the most menacing of all, the cute little babies. He looks so dope here. Oh wow. I love his claws. The silver claws. He just looks like the greatest Nightwing ever. Oh, the markings and everything. These just have so many little details that you might miss. Oh, I just love looking at them and holding them in my hands. And obviously we don't know what happens to Moros here and what kind of a dragon he is. But he is still super, super cute in plushy form. We have two more remaining. Let's see if we get Tsunami. Oh man, I see a little bit of blue. We'll see if it's glory or tsunami. Yes, it's tsunami. We officially have the entire collection of cutie cuffs. This is a wonderful shade of blue. Man, just, I know I keep saying this, but the way they just nailed the designs. I mean, this is exactly how she looks down to the different royal patterns and the markings on her eyes and the different shades of colors. Wow, I'm absolutely blown away by the quality in these. Seriously, like, they could have just done something simple, but these really are Wings of Fire plushies. They can't be mistaken for anything else. And I'm so, so happy about how faithful they are. And that you can actually hold one of the Dragons of Destiny or one of their villains in your hands. You know, for this being the first official Wings of Fire merchandise, I am so, so happy. In our last and final cutie cuff, let's see if it's a triplet with Glory or Tsunami's twin. It's Tsunami's twin! Let's go! Oh my goodness. This, and honestly, is like my third favorite of them. Seriously. Just the way her design is translated her cute little tail. This is so, so neat. Wow, 12 different cutie cuffs. We got one of each of these dragons. I am absolutely blown away by how the merchandise looks and how it feels. And here is the aftermath of unboxing all of these. This is such an awesome experience. And the Scarlet one will hold a wonderful place in my heart. This one is definitely my favorite. I will put on my bed. I love them all so, so much. Getting to unbox these was really a special treat. And by the way, guys, the box says 3+. plus. So you can tell your little siblings to keep their hands off of your cutie cuffs because they are not allowed <laughs> to unbox them for you. These are wonderful treats for Wings of Fire fans. I'm so glad I got this wonderful opportunity to look at them and review them for you guys because these designs are just stellar and I really could not ask for anything better. And now we have seen them as mostly plushies, but let's see how they fare as actual slap bracelets. Great Scarlet hurt me. She's a little a little too small for my arm. But this is so cute. Oh my goodness. Because the fact that you can have just one of your favorite characters in the whole world just on your arm. You can just bring them anywhere with you. There are plushies not only for you to just cuddle with and to and to see for the first time in person, see these designs, 
but you can also bring them with you places. And I absolutely love that they're on the go, whether you're in your house or at the store or anything, you can tag along when your favorite Wings of Fire friends. Well, guys, I can't wait to show up this way to school. I put them all on. No way. Oh, my goodness. I have all the cutie cuffs on. This is a beautiful fashion choice. They're so tight. It's like a boa constrictor on my arms. I have my fingers, too. Oh, my goodness. This is so much fun. I am literally wings of fire. Like, I'm. if you put these all over your body, you're literally wings of fire incarnate. You have all the dragons. I can even fit all of them on my arms for this. Oh, but this is hilarious. I absolutely love having them on. <laughs> They're sticking on. Oh my goodness, I love this so much. Queen Scarlet, what are you doing on my brother's spicy sriracha and mayonnaise? Oh my goodness. Oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, what do I say? Like, I'm just gonna get myself a snack here, and what is that? Is that Queen Scarlet? What are you doing with the sriracha's? No, I can't speak. I was just gonna get a snack here and a... Who is this? Queen Scarlet, what are you doing on the spicy mayonnaise? Oh my goodness, I absolutely love her. Look who I just discovered on the Lysol bottle, trying to aim her venom at the other dragon heads. I'm actually in an active struggle with Glory right now. <laughs> Stop! <laughs> the aftermath of the battle. She got the floor all wet. All right, guys. So here we have all 12 of our cutie cuffs. We got each of the eight dragons. This was such a wonderful opportunity. And there are just so many of them, and they are so, so good. Thank you so much for Bulls the Toy for sending me these. This was an awesome opportunity, and I'm really glad I got to look at and review my favorite dragons in this video for you guys. And that's pretty much it for this video. I'm super glad that I got all of the wings for our cutie cuffs, and I hope you can get some of your favorites too. Who knows, maybe we'll get more Bulls the Toy wings for our merchandise in the future. Things are just starting out for this series' as merch lines, and I can't wait to see what other things Scholastic will have made. Thank you all so much for watching, and huge thanks to Bulls Toy for doing this. Comment your favorite cutie cuff down below, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!